Well, on Saturday, among all the other festivities, we'll be honoring some four to five hundred Purple Heart recipients, the largest gathering ever on American soil. A special moment for the veterans and everyone in attendance, but especially important for two of our own. It's always very honored that, that he represented our country and, and uh, fought for our country and, and going through that. Uh, I can't even imagine, and I've told him that on many occasions. And, and to have a dad that was a Marine and receive a Purple Heart, it's always been a huge source of honor and pride for me. What do I remember about the military life of Guffrey Smith? Well, just how proud he was of his, um, of his service to our country. Tim Kingsbury, a Marine in Vietnam, and the late Guffrey Smith Sr. of the 92nd Infantry and member of the Buffalo Soldiers in World War II both enlisting to fight for our country, both receiving Purple Hearts, and both with extremely proud sons. He volunteered, which is, it makes it even more incredible for me, uh, based upon the easy life I had. I mean, he, he chose to go fight for his country, and like I said, it's just always been a, a, a very big source of pride in my life. He kept his uniform and his medals, and to this day we, I'm looking at it on my, on my phone, I keep that available to me, just to remind me and it's some of those reminders, some of those lessons that have helped make these men and these coaches who they are today. In basketball, I've been able to, to understand, hey, if the point guard, here's your, here's your responsibility. You know, if you do your job, just do your job. You don't have to worry about what the shooting guard does, what the power forward does, center. He's got a job to do. And even my dad would always talk about that. This is when you get in trouble, son. When you try to do your job and somebody else's job, those are things that, that have helped me in my coaching and teaching. Nothing is, is too bad at work on, on a daily basis compared to what he's been through and what he went through and, and fought for for this country. I think it'll be a special game for him just knowing that there's you know, so many of his peers are there that have been through similar situations to him and have fought for this country and for the reason we have our freedom. So I know it'll mean a lot for him to be there and hopefully we can, we can send it out the right way.